I'm holding in my hand one of the most incredible pieces of tissue from the human body. It's called an amniotic membrane and it comes from donated placenta. This powerful little piece of tissue aids in sustaining and growing a life, but it also holds the power to heal your cornea. In today's video, I'll show you how. Welcome to iSchool with Dr. D, where my goal is to arm you with the knowledge you need to take control of your eye health and have the best vision possible. Like and subscribe for videos every week. You've made it to iSchool with me, Dr. D. In today's lesson, we're going over the Procara Slim, an amniotic membrane with the ability to heal your cornea. Before we get into today's video, I'd like to invite you to join in my iEducation community by subscribing. And if you like this video, be sure to hit the like button so that YouTube knows this content is helpful. Today's video is sponsored by Biotissue, the folks at Procara, and they did send me a membrane that I will show you today. All opinions are my own. If a membrane made from placental tissue that has the power to heal your cornea got your attention, I promise you that wasn't clickbait. So many of our widely used dry eye therapies just manage symptoms. Artificial tears are a prime example. But an amniotic membrane graft like the Procara Slim actually has the ability to heal the ocular surface and return your cornea to its natural and optimal state. Procara reduces inflammation, provides quick relief, and actually heals your cornea. Beyond dry eye, Procara membranes can also be used for repeated epithelial defects or erosions, chronic inflammation, scarring, even vision loss and pain. Procara is FDA cleared and is a cryopreserved amniotic membrane. It supports the corneal healing process without harmful side effects. Because it is cryopreserved, it maintains full biologic and structural integrity equivalent to using fresh tissue. So this is in comparison to dehydrated membranes, which your doctor also would have access to, but those do lose critical biologic components during the drying process. So what Procara is able to do, or using an amniotic membrane, is to facilitate neutrophil apoptosis. It polarizes m true macrophages and suppresses Th1 and Th17 lymphocyte activation in order to reduce inflammation. It prevents myofibroblast differentiation to prevent scarring. It maintains stem cell quiescence to promote regenerative healing. And all in all, all the things that promote growth in a fetus, you can imagine would also promote growth and healing in the human cornea. And that's essentially what we do with the Procara membrane. We're harnessing the healing power of the amnion. Amniotic membranes are able to be billed to your insurance, so this isn't usually an out-of-pocket expense unless you have a high deductible plan. So here's what to expect. Your doctor will insert the membrane. The tissue is within a holding disc and the whole thing is inserted into your eye. It stays there for about seven days as the membrane slowly disintegrates and your eye heals. Sometimes it is necessary to tape your eyelids shut while the membrane is in place. At your follow-up, your doctor will remove the remainder of the membrane and the plastic disc, at which point your cornea should be nicely healed. I've been using amniotic membranes for the past seven to eight years, and the healing they provide is truly amazing. I've seen them heal terrible recurrent erosions, dry eye, and non-healing corneas in no time at all. If you do have one of these conditions we discussed in the video, make sure to ask your doctor if an amniotic membrane might heal your cornea. And if you've ever tried an amniotic membrane, make sure to share your experience down below in the comment section. I love to hear from you guys. Thanks again to Procara for sponsoring our video today. That is gonna to be it for today's iSchool lesson. Class is dismissed, I will see you next time.